imagine your gut as a vibrant garden. For it to flourish, it needs a variety of good bacteria, just like a garden needs diverse plants. Probiotics are the seeds that you plant in your garden, and they grow and make your garden better. Meanwhile, prebiotics are the healthy food that you give your garden, like a special plant food that helps your good seeds grow and become stronger. But, what exactly are the differences between probiotics and prebiotics? Let's take a closer look. Prebiotics consist of non-digestible fibers. Probiotics are live bacteria. Prebiotics feed existing gut bacteria. Probiotics introduce new gut bacteria. Prebiotics are found in foods such as garlic, onions, bananas, and apples. Probiotics are found in fermented foods such as yogurt, kefir, and sauerkraut, as well as in supplements. Prebiotics help to improve digestion and absorption of nutrients. Probiotics improve gut health and immune function. Prebiotics are not sensitive to heat or stomach acid. Probiotics may be killed by heat, stomach acid, or antibiotics. Prebiotics typically have little to no risk of overconsumption, depending on your health. Probiotics may cause adverse effects with overconsumption. In conclusion, both prebiotics and probiotics play important roles in supporting gut health. While prebiotics act as food for the good bacteria in your gut, probiotics introduce new good bacteria into your system. Incorporating both prebiotics and probiotics into your diet can work synergistically to improve your gut health and overall well-being. So, start nourishing your gut garden with a combination of prebiotic and probiotic-rich foods today. If you enjoyed this video, you'll be sure to enjoy this one. Also, be sure to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications so you get notified when I release a new video. Be sure to check out some of the recipes on my channel as well.